Hey everybody, welcome to my YouTube channel. In the summer of 1990, NBC Television tested a pilot for a new sitcom called Blossom, which would star Maya Bialik as the title's main character Blossom, and Jenna Von Oy as Blossom's best friend, Six Lemure. The show would go on to run for a full five seasons before going off the air. Now in this video, I am taking a look at what actress Jenna Von Oy has been doing since Blossom went off the air in 1995. Now before being cast in Blossom, Jenna Von Oy had already made a couple of appearances on TV including being in an episode of Tales from the Dark Side from the third season called Seasons of Belief. She had also been in an episode from the fourth season of Kate and Allie called Dearly Beloved. Additionally, she had a small role in the 1989 film Born on the 4th of July. However, it would be the role of Six Lemure on Blossom that would be Jenna Von Oy's first major role on a television series. Blossom would air on Monday nights following The Fresh Prince of Bel Air where it experienced decent and steadily improving ratings until the Fox Television Network moved Melrose Place from its original Wednesday night time slot to Monday nights. Suddenly, Blossom found itself competing against Fox's more steamy Melrose Place, and Blossom producers were given specific instructions to avoid issue-oriented shows. It was time for what NBC programming executive Bob Levy would describe as family fun, family fun. He would go on to say that they couldn't be as aggressive in tackling the sexual issues as Melrose Place could, and since they have the franchise on sexy young adult TV and we're not going to beat them at their game, so they decided to go back to their roots as a family show. Ultimately, the plan didn't work out so well. Ratings dropped in that final season, leading to NBC's decision to cancel the show, with the final episode airing on May 22, 1995. After Blossom went off the air, Jenna decided to attend film school at the University of Southern California School of Cinematic Arts for two years before leaving to return to acting. Her next recurring role was in the UPN sitcom The Parkers, which aired for five seasons from 1999 to 2004. After portraying the definitive BFF as Six from Blossom, she would go on to play another main character's best friend on The Parkers, Stevie Van Lowe, the quirky best friend of Kim Parker, the show's main character. After The Parkers, Jenna decided to follow a different passion, music. She has released two albums, Breathing Room from 2007 and Coffee and Men in 2009. Then in 2015, she released a book called Situation Momedy. It was a guide for first-time mothers with the goal of helping them through pregnancy and beyond. Now these days, Jenna continues to balance being a mother and a musician, but she hasn't ruled out the future of acting again, so who knows? Perhaps it won't be that long before we see her again on TV. It's great to see that Jenna is staying busy and doing the things she loves in life. Now, what are your favorite memories of Jenna Von Oy? I look forward to reading your comments. Also, I would greatly appreciate it if you would consider subscribing to my channel, where I generally talk about the TV shows, music, and movies that I loved while growing up in the 70s, 80s, and 90s. Thank you so much for watching. Stay safe out there, and have a great day.